Hello everybody, Stephen Ram here from Rare Nerds. Welcome to part 5 of my Amnesia Let's Play. Um, we've now finally made it to the refinery. So we see what lays ahead for us. A little flashback. It sure is dark in here. Yes, and there's a good reason for it. But you can light the lamp now if you wish. What's the reason? For the darkness, that is. Stay close. Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Daniel. It's important that you keep going straight and make sure not to stray. Okay. Dark and foreboding. Noises. It's been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. An excessive decision, in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it, but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same object. Could I have imagined it all? Was there ever a complete orb? Hmm, interesting. So perhaps he is imagining it. My sanity dropped this much. I'm not even doing anything. I can't say. I can't tell you that I'm actually reasonably get fed of the sanity system. It just seems so arbitrary. It goes down so bloody quick. This may be a bloody explosion. I'm sure I've just seen some people just move around in the. and wait for the sound to go up. Oh, I'm crying out loud. It's official, I hate the sound of mechanic. If I can find a way to hack it and turn off, I will do. Lot 
lights on the lantern. Perhaps I've been too um, concerned with my tinder boxes, perhaps I need to use them more. I've got 16 of them, but I just call it game intuition. I just I'm used to not having to holding on to all the good stuff to later on. And then you never of course you never use any of it, you just hold on to it and never use it. So if you had a can just then, that's caused tonight's alcoholic beverage is strong bone. Not great cider, but reasonably good. Hmm. Dawn a hand. My dog has been particularly loud tonight. It's a skill she's picked up many, many, many years ago. Okay. I'm guessing this is what I need to do then. Oh, bloody hell, burnt some oil. I need to find a way to, some way to, to um, open that trap door. Sanity's still shockingly low. I really need to stand here and wait for this to build up. Well, she did it. The sanity drops so low so quick, but it takes bloody forever to recover it. It's really horrible. I am so glad they ditched it for machine for pigs. Literally say this is oh, this is irritating. Okay, sound just got up a little bit. Let's have a look around the rest of this area. Uh, I have a feeling this is the. Oh, that's pleasant. On 25th of June, 1839, I feel the need to continue this journal, even though it was intended for my journey to Africa. This must be something very important. I just know it. I've taken it upon myself to piece the orb back together, but it's been more difficult than one might think. The pieces are behaving strangely. They seem to change colour, shape and texture, but ever so slightly. Yesterday, I took careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirmed my suspicions. They were changing. I was terrified and rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care and we discussed how rocks change form. He told me about the nature of glass how it eventually collapses on itself, like ice slowly melting over the Not course true. of centuries. Smith eased my mind a bit, but I can't escape the feeling that these shards have otherworldly properties. I think he's referring to the myth that glass... <laughs> Shit, what's going on? Oh my word. That is painful. Come on. I think what we're referring to there is the myth that glass flows because it never trees. So this has come from the fact that glass is a um it has no real discernible liquid form whenever we turn to true liquid. So there's a myth that game when that glass still flows. People would say that oh that's why if you look at old windows the glass is um fixed at the bottom. That's a load of rubbish. It's absolute rubbish, you know. As someone pointed out that if that was the case, that would mean that glass would you know, older buildings would have no glass toilet or sort of flowed away. It's because 
glass, red glass maybe in it thick parts, so you always put the thick part of the box, it made logical sense, wouldn't you? I would. in the background. Sorry if you can hear this, I do apologise for the dog in the background. Right, I'll get through here. Okay. So. Something's jamming this. What's clocking it? by hand, okay. What can we do? How can we lift this? How can we lift this? Muscles can I carry? Is it a hundred? Right, so how do I block this? So So I'm just going to climb the bridge action, so what is it? place to end our next part of our let's play so before we get this nice another little click out the cliffhanger so i look forward to seeing you on the next one um very much for watching see you next time thank you